Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So this week's Monday must-have is on the new Wet n Wild Fire Dragon vs. Ice Dragon collection. So if you'd like to see me um, try everything that's in this box, um, then please keep on watching. Also make sure that you guys, you know, subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell. Um, bookmark my page. I upload a video every single day of the week and I don't want you guys to miss any. Um, just this beautiful box set um, from Wet n Wild's website. And guys, they had a deal going on where everything online was 30% off. So I got this whole entire set for less than 30 bucks with free shipping. It's usually $40, so I saved 10 bucks off of it. So guys, this set does come with um, two eyeshadow quads, um, four loose pigments, two bronzers, which the bronzers are new, two new limited edition highlighters, and four liquid metallic lipsticks. So, guys, I'm going to be doing half my face with the cool, half my face with the warm. Um, I got two of each brush, so that way we aren't mixing colors or anything. So I'm super excited to get this done. Okay, guys, my eyes are primed to set as usual. I am wearing mascara. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and start off with the eyes. I'm going to do a simple look so that way the video isn't super long. So guys, um, the cool quad is called Mythical Mythical Creatures. Okay, so this is the cool quad. And then the warm quad is called Fit for a Queen. Really, really pretty. Okay, so I am super, super excited to try these out. Um, I love most Wet n Wild things. Really, really good quality, guys. They are cruelty-free, and they are a very, very affordable drugstore, but do you need to buy, you know, this collection? This is what this is all about, first impressions. So guys, this purple shade, it looks like a duochrome in the pan. That is very, very light. Huh. Pretty, though. Kind of not showing up very... Okay. Okay, guys, so... I'm going to go ahead and start with the transition shade. This looks like a shade that's in the uh, Rosé in the Air palette. But let's just get this put on. It's really, really pretty though. Okay. I love Wet n Wild shadows. They are awesome. Okay. And then... We're going to go to do the crease color, which is this blue. There's a little bit of shimmer, but it might be the type where it disappears as you blend it. Ooh, that's a pretty blue. Really pretty and smoky. Let's do a little bit underneath. That's pretty. Blends out really easily like that. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and grab some of the cool shimmers. I might not be able to use everything on my face, but so guys, one of the cool shimmers, it's called Tonight's Blue, and then there is a kind of silvery white shade, and it's called Ice Ice Lady. So let's go ahead and see what these look like. Sorry guys, I haven't even like swatched anything or touched anything. Got home from work and got it in the mail. I'm like, I gotta try it out. I've never tried any of their loose pigments before. So let's see what this looks like. So guys, this is Ice Ice Lady. Ooh, that is pretty. And then... Tonight's blue. Let's see what this looks like. And guys, I'll probably just do a really quick lip swatch of all the four lipstick shades. Let's see what this blue looks like. That is pretty too. Wow, that is gorgeous. Okay, I think I'm going to use... Um, Let's do the blue on part of the lid. I'm just going to use my finger. You could definitely use a brush. But and then I think we're going to use the white shade, the silvery white shade um, on the inner corner. Okay. 
And I'm going to blend this out, guys. Okay, so let's get some of that white shade and put it on the inner corner. So far, this is really, really pretty. Guys, I haven't even unbought, um, like, I haven't even tried the mermaid collection. I feel so bad. I need to try that. Okay, I'm gonna go in with that brush. Get this blended out a little. I'm gonna dip back into the transition color and uh, get this kind of blended. Guys, that's the cool. I like it a lot. I like the blue that's in the quad, and I like the blue that's in the um, loose pigment. I like so. Once again, really, really pretty. Like that transition shade. Let's go ahead and try that out. Back and forth. And guys, I know it's not the best eye looks, but uh, just really quick, just so you guys can see what they're looking like. It's a nice transition shade though, I like that. Okay, and then this really pretty kind of burgundy. That is pretty. Let's go and put that in the crease because that is the crease color. Ooh, guys, that is pigmented, really, really pretty. I like that. It's nice. Underneath the eye. And then this gold is the lit shade. Ooh, guys, that is really pretty. That is a pretty gold. Okay, guys, pretty. Let's go ahead and, ooh, that is really, really pretty. I like that shade. That's gorgeous. I like that. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and try the uh, gilded crown on the inner part. I'm excited for these pigments. They seem really, really nice. Really, really pretty. Let's go ahead and... I think a sticky base would work great with these pigments. That is pretty. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and grab my brush and get this blended out. But uh, really, really nice so far. I like both. I do like the warm, which I never was a huge warm fan, but uh, I'm really, really liking it. Okay, let's go ahead and um, let's try the bronzers. So both bronzers are on the warm side, so I will swatch both bronzers. But uh, yeah, these are their new um, Wet n Wild Color Icon Bronzers. And um, we got one shade, and this looks like the cooler shade. It's called You're Dragging Me Down. And guys, it does have a little dragon. So let's get a clean finger. That is really soft. That's pretty. And then the other shade is called um, Queensland. This one does look a little warmer. It's, it's again super soft, guys. I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll just try it. Guys, once again, I got Two different Wet n Wild contour brushes. I don't know. They look really close. Okay, let's just go ahead and try on this side. So, guys, this is Queensland. It's a nice warm bronzer. That's pretty. Okay, on the other brush, we're gonna be digging in. To you're dragging me down. No fluff up at all, guys. So I think there are four different contour shades. 
or bronzers, so there might be some cooler ones, but uh, I think they're both doable. I think you're dragging me down. I think it's a little bit better for my skin tone, but really, really pretty still. Okay. Okay, guys, now let's go ahead and move on to the highlights. So, guys, um, this pretty white one is called Winter Falls in L.A. Let's go ahead and get her popped open. Guys, if you have not tried Wet n Wild's um, Make Glow Highlighting Powders, you need to, guys. They're like $4.99, and they are gorgeous. Okay, so it looks like it has like kind of like a decorative snowflake on it. This hand is getting, ooh, that is so soft. Ooh, guys, that has like almost a duochrome effect to it. That is beautiful. And then this shade is called Halo Walkers. This is a fun shade. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to wear it a lot, but uh, it's really, really pretty. Guys, they're so soft. Ooh, that would make a beautiful, um, eyeshadow color though, but we're going to try both. Okay, so we're going to use the blue one, which is the Halo Walkers. Okay, um, we're going to use it on the cool side. So guys, two different highlighting brushes, so let's go ahead and give this a go. Really pretty though. It's going to be too dark, but gives a cool effect. It's pretty. Um, yeah, I would definitely use this as a shadow instead of a, but that just totally added a whole nother dimension to this cool look. That's pretty. I like this a lot. Okay, and then let's go ahead and do Winter Falls in LA. Ooh, that is pretty guys, that is gorgeous. And let's go ahead and do a little bit on the inner corner. That is pretty. Okay. So, let's go ahead. Guys, we're almost done. Thanks for sticking through it. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and try the liquid lipsticks. Guys, so these are the liquid lipsticks. So we have the warm ones, which has fire on the cap, and then the cool ones have little... Um, icicles. Really, really cute little detail. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and try the cool ones first. Okay. So, yeah, guys, this is um, icing on the wall. Really, really pretty navy blue shade. like this one a lot. So, this is the other cool shade, and this is Shall We Stay? It's a really pretty cool grayish brown. I like this one a lot. Really, really pretty. Hey guys, this is the first warm shade, and it's in the shade Queen's Blood. I really, really like this pretty coppery shade. Um, this formula of li liquid lipsticks, the uh, liquid catsuit metallic lipsticks, they're super comfortable. Really, really like the shade. It's really, really pretty. This is the last warm shade, and it's in the shade Red Leans. Um, I really, really like this shade, too. It's really, really pretty. So, guys, that is the collection I did get from Wet n Wild. I bought it myself, as the usual. Guys, I really think it's a really, really nice collection. I would definitely recommend all of it. I mean, it just depends on what you like. If you like a cool tone, if you want like that pretty sultry blue, then I would maybe just pick up the cool collection if you only like one of the lipsticks. Okay, guys, you guys don't need to buy the whole thing. Um, I would definitely recommend checking out wetandwild.com. They do have sales quite a bit. Um, but I really, really love the warm side. I really, really love the eyeshadow quad and the lipsticks. Love all the lipsticks. They're great. I like the um, Winter Falls in L.A., this highlighter, it's really, really pretty. The blue one, it's really pretty, but it's just not super wearable for me, but I would definitely use it as an eyeshadow. I like both quads a lot. Um, I think I would definitely get more use, especially with the time of year coming up, I think I'd get more use out of the warm quad, but the blue is really, really pretty too. They blend it out great. Um, love the uh, loose um, pigments. Really, really nice formula so far. Definitely going to have to play around with them some more. But in my book, guys, the new Wet n Wild Fire Dragon versus Ice Dragon, guys, it's definitely a Monday must-have. I would definitely recommend going and checking out wetnwild.com. Maybe go to your local store, see what they got. Pick up a few pieces if you want, um, but I'm really glad I picked up the whole collection that they had. Um, and um, yeah, book. 
the new Wet n Wild Fire Dragon versus Ice Dragon. Guys, it is definitely a Monday must-have. I really, really love it a lot. Um, if you did enjoy this week's Monday must-have, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Also, make sure that you guys share this video. Let's get the word out. There's probably people interested and want to know what they should buy, if they should pick it up. And, um, you know, I really, really like it and for less than 30 bucks. And plus, I got a free gift, which is the uh, new Wet n Wild. It's the little dragon highlighting brush. So really, really pretty. Love that I got this as a free gift, too. Um, but yeah, go ahead and share this video. Guys, also make sure you leave a comment down below. Have you picked up the new Wet n Wild Fire Dragon versus Ice Dragon? Have you picked up anything from the collection? If you have, what did you get and do you like it? If you haven't, why haven't you yet? Do you like Wet n Wild? And guys, also make sure you guys follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. It's all at Budget Glam Babe. I will see you guys tomorrow for another video. Have a great one, guys.